no, 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 no. It's not like, huh. well, this is different. Bish, I'm a sheep. Bish, I'm a sheep. Hello there, beautiful people. Welcome back to my channel. I hope you are doing well today. I'm finally doing it. I feel like I'm gonna say your prayers have been answered. I doubt you've been praying for this, but I know a lot of people have been asking me to do a fashion video, get some clothing, try on some goodies. You wanna see what Patricia is liking at the moment. And I feel like we're in transition. It's not exactly autumn yet, but really the way that the weather has been disrespecting me, I feel like it, it is autumn. It is autumn in August, that's fine. And as you can see, I have my autumn lip on. I am so excited. If you guys don't know, I created my own lipstick with MAC Cosmetics. It's mad, mind blown. I have a link in the description bar below for anyone who's been wanting to know about this lip color, how to pick it up, but I have all the links in the description bar below. But yeah, your girl is wearing her own. Her own lipstick. It's mad. You can support me if you wanna go out and get some goodies. And in the meantime, I think we should just talk about what your girls found shopping recently. I don't know if I've, I've told you this, but I've had some really bad experiences shopping online. I've received some stuff that have been so trashed. I've just been like, you know what? I'm so disappointed. You guys saw my IMG video. I bought some other stuff from like this other smaller website and it was just a pamphlet with string. It was just not a good look. I decided to hit the high street. Da, 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 da. Hitting the high street for all my American followers is like hitting the mall and there's brands like Topshop, Zara that you guys have, Mango, River Island, all these shops that are, you know, are more high street-y brands. I just decided to go and see what I could find and I realized I hate shopping. It's literally an exercise. It's a workout. Why am I doing it? Why am I sweating? I could be sweating in my dressing gown, drinking hot chocolate and shopping, but I was physically sweating when I was out in the streets. Meanwhile, when I was younger, I used to sh shop the streets all the time. Like it was what I did every weekend and I loved it. Like I used to dress up to go shopping and I'll go shopping to buy more clothes, to dress up to go shopping to buy clothes. It's weird, right? So yeah, I hit the streets, found what I could find. I brought everything back because you know what? The dressing rooms are hell we don't go into the dressing rooms. So I'm gonna try everything on from the high street that I could possibly find for you guys. And I feel like I've got a great mix of bougie and a great mix of thoughts. I'm very excited. We're gonna be a bougie thought. Hey, let's do this. It's real busy, there's a lot of people here, but it's all good, you can make it work. And my tip is to come on a Tuesday afternoon, because there's not that many people around. Let's talk shop. Once I'm out here, you can't stop me. The side struggle in store is so real. I feel like I need to share with you the bag of the goodies of the goodies Zara, Mango, Topshop, Bershka, River Island, High Street favorites. I like having bags. This jumper, I saw this neon jumper. I didn't try it on, but I thought it looked kind of cute, kind of nice. Okay, 49 pounds. The High Street is definitely not as cheap as online. Vibrance, can you guys see it? It's a blinding, it's blinding right now. Um, I'm gonna try on. This is a size small, but I really feel like this, no, it's giving me imp arms. This is giving me big bird. But like that, it's nice. So I really wish it was really oversized and like 
off shoulder i should have got a large like that i mean we can still wear it you, you guys know what i say about the shoulder i love this little necklace i'll have it linked down below my girl xena makes these i feel like it goes so nice with it but why are the arms so short the arms are giving me oompa loompa though so i need a medium or large to get the look that i want oh my gosh oh my gosh these are so stunning these are like paper bag shorts now if you've watched me for long enough you actually know i i've always had a leather obsession it's a bit of a thing for me i've always been really into leather and i just think it's really sexy and cute and i remember i did a video like styling all leather um outfits and i remember like basically there are people who've got like a leather fetish fetish and i'd get all the fetish people commenting on my video and be like oh could you do another leather video and can you show your toes very disgusting very creepy anyway paper bag shorts i love them so here are the shorts on definitely doing paper bag and everything yeah my bum is really glossifying right now it looks very glossy i feel like if my legs are together i'm getting tooth and camel but i feel like if my legs are apart we're looking cute. I like the shape of it. This is the thing, right? Sometimes clothing is angles. Like together, I feel like it's giving me square, but apart, angles, it looks really nice. Oh, I, I love them, I die. I'd wear them with some boots. Yes! I love a little paper bag short. I feel like they look classy, but fun at the same time. These are 29 pounds from Mango. <gasps> No, I like them. I think they're beautiful. I think they can be added to my wardrobe. Amazing. I know some people are gonna hate this. <laughs> I don't know if this is bougie or not. I think this is more like grandma, but I remember there was this dress last year that so many girls had from H&M. It was like this like woolly dress and it was so flattering, flattering and stuff. And I have no problem with like long outfits like this with trainers. I feel like this is gonna look beautiful on and it's giving me comfort and I love the color. I'm so excited. I'm going to live my best mooching lifestyle in this. Bitch, I'm a cow. Bitch, I'm a cow. <laughs> this dress is giving me sexy supply teacher and I'm here for it. There's something about feeling very comfortable in an outfit that makes me feel good. I am a, I go for comfort first. And look at this, look at it with trainers. I feel like with trainers, this actually looks really nice. Would Erica, would you wear this? You wouldn't wear this, would you? Let me see. I would, you know. It's nice, isn't it? Yeah, with a cute trainer. Okay, with a cute trainer, we can wear it. I got the young folks telling me I can wear this. <laughs> I like it, no, no. I feel like some of you guys are going to really hate this and some of you guys are gonna like it if you feel me on that deeper level that comfort is important let me know and for those of you who think like i just look like a rough supply teacher let me know as well but this is just a just gorgeous little slouchy dress it's got the buttons going down oh you can't open it up imagine if i could like open it up like i can make it from you know sophisticated to sexy oh these jeans i saw these dreams straight leg vintage style jeans organic cotton i love the idea of organic cotton when it comes to denim and just in general and these just look buff i do find um straight leg jeans quite flattering but you have to get the right jean i think these look good i don't know if you guys can see them or if they're too bright but it's got this really nice dark stitching all over it which i think makes it stand out even more Mwah! okay so here are these jeans um <laughs> I think the one thing I'm struggling with at the moment has been jeans. It fits all here and then here doesn't fit. What do you guys do? So it's weird, like here's tight, here's tight, here's, here's loose. But I think a, a belt can fix that. Oh, my bum looks wonderful from the box. He looks wonderful, it looks good. It looks like contained, it looks co contained and it looks perky. I think I'm just gonna have to get a belt I love the leg of the jean, love the leg of the jean. Oh my God, these are really, really nice. How much are these? 35 pounds, not bad. Really, really hard denim, hard denim. I think they're super flattering. Wear with a belt, get a larger size. That's what I think I need. But these are banging. So next up, Topshop. I got some Topshop goodies. You see, Topshop, Topshop is expensive. 
But there's some goodies there. And I, look at this. I'm clearly obsessed with bright colors. Plus it's my sister's birthday. So I wanted to wear something really like bright and dramatic. This is actually from Mistress Rocks. Oh my gosh. I'm gonna be a lemon. Well, this is different. Supply teacher by day, line thought by night. Um, this is a little two piece. This is a, from a Mistress Rock. Ooh, booty popping. I cannot, I could not. This is really a lot.com. Yeah, part of me would love to, part of me would love to wear it, but part of me is like, this is too, too much for you, girl. This is too much for you, girl. So basically, carnival season is in the air. It's my sister's birthday. We've got this scene where we're all wearing really bright colors. So I wanted to look for something that was a little bit like out of this world and a bit dramatic and bright. And um, yeah, this, this is definitely dramatic and bright. I feel like the top is too small. It's literally this big. Do I like it? I don't know. I feel like I do. I just don't know how comfortable I would feel out and about like this. I tried, didn't I? I saw it, I tried it. Um, maybe if you guys see me on my Instagram wearing this, then you know I was confident enough to actually wear it out. I think I could rock that. I think I could rock it. My breastuses are feeding the world. They're feeding the world. I do think I could wear it for like the bank holiday season, but I don't see me wearing it again. But I would wear it as separate. So we're, we're, we're good, we like this. Hey, we've got another shiny two piece. So I picked this up specifically for carnival. I don't normally go, but this year, like my sister's birthday falls on the same weekend. I was like, you know what? Let's do something fun. We're gonna go. Look at this, giving me spaceship. Meanwhile, how much did this cost? This cost 14 pounds. I spent $90 from IMGR, the label, and the thing is torn. How much is this? 15 pounds. I love this. I love this little, Listen, this is not for every day. We are not going to wear this to a wedding, people. This is for my little carnival, soca moments, do a little tiny What? Listen, booty popping. My bum is shining. It's glistening like the sun, we're reflecting. I like this because it goes down. It isn't actually so short. I much prefer boob tube. The fact that we're wearing boob tube in 2018, but you know, boob tubes are a thing in 2018. But I feel like this is so nice for like, some soca vibe. Hey, I think this is cute. I know, I feel like I'm a little too old for this, but do you know what? You can have fun one day a year where you get a little bit dressed up. I actually feel like these shorts fit really nicely. They're really nice. They've got like all this little flicker in it. And then this is gonna reflect all the light. Oh, I'm so excited. Thanks Topshop, it's not for every day. Again, someday supply teacher, someday carnival queen. Queen. Hey, okay, we're done. I think I'm obsessed with two pieces right now. Another two piece, this is a much more casual two piece and I'm obsessed with long skirts right now. I think this is going to be so cute. Here we go, we've brought it back a little bit. Um, this is not supply teacher, this is just cute little two piece. I love this top. This top is so banging. And the skirt, look at the skirt. Well, hello there, booty. Again, this is one that I would wear with trainers or boots. I like clothing that I can wear multiple wear ways. This is making my day, because this is really nice. Oh, little two-piece, it's marching, it's cured. I love this. It's autumn, but not too autumn. We're very happy with Topshop. We like this. The material's not too thin. So the skirt is 29 pounds and the top is 22 pounds. Listen, I need to be wearing this combo morning, noon and night, but it's really, really nice. I really like the material. It feels really nice. I feel like it's really flattering. I've also learned another secret, crossing the leg, twisting. It's an angle, it works. Oh, this top looks so nice. This is 100% me. It's on the shoulder, but off the shoulder. <sighs> Please look cute on. This top on. It's a bit short. I don't know if the arms are meant to be this short on me. I think I picked up a petite top. Don't matter, I will wear petite and I'll also wear size 12, 14, 16, 18. If I like the outfit, I don't even care what size it is. I'll just wear it. <laughs> Put it on, finesse it with a belt or something. Do the arms look like they're meant to be like that or does it look like the material's missing? All this bit I really like. I love the shoulders, 
because I know. Okay, so you can't wear it off the shoulder without looking like you're struggling for life. Now I don't know if I like it. I'm feeling a little bit little Bo Peep now. <sighs> Do I like it? I love the colour. I love the shoulders. I love the ruching. I feel like this bit's a bit of a weird length. It's not like long in the body. It's really short in the body. And I feel like there's going to be a gap, a weird gap there. But I love the style of the top. Why is everything so cropped? I did see this, I thought it was nice. I think I've changed my mind. Why is it corduroy? Why is it a weird length? I don't know if I like it. Actually, I like this top on. We're gonna forgive the crop. We're gonna forgive the crop. 2018, everything's crop. It's not going anywhere. Very jarring. But we're gonna forgive it because I actually think this is really nice. I like the way it looks on. I like the way my boobies look in it. It's not like, I think it's just really nice. I like the thick straps as well. And I like the corduroy. Who would have thought a girl would have liked corduroy? Patricia doing too much. I swear I end up buying so much of the same bloody thing just because I think they look nice. This was, I feel like I've got a cow neck top like this. I live for the color. I live for the color. I couldn't find any of my sizes in this. This is a size 12 or 14, but I feel like I could wear this. Like, you know what? Don't let the numbers on the hanger stop you from picking up the item, unless like you won't be able to breathe if you wear it. This top or this top, I think it's gonna have to be, let's try it on. I die, I die, I die, I love it, I love it. I don't have a bra on right now and you wouldn't even know. <laughs> My nips can be free, they can be so happy. I love, love what this looks like. I love the way it drops. The, meanwhile, this is a size 12, or if not a size 14. I'm more like a size eight to 10. Doesn't matter, doesn't matter. Meanwhile, it's creased up. It is actually creased, but a little steam is gonna get this out. And I love the idea of wearing it with a little bodycon skirt to give it some shape. The color even looks elegant. The color makes it look more expensive. It's like gold. <laughs> you are gold, gold, oh, when you are expensive darling this is my bougie we found the bougie i'm so elegant with a hitch elegant so this is on bershka pinstripe trousers and they just look so comfortable we've got more bougie um here are these trousers i really like them i just feel like they're too small why is everything so small sizing is such a weird thing like I picked up a small, but I feel like I need a medium. I think they're really, really nice. I think they look really, really good on, but they're just too small. My crotch looks great though. There's no camelage going on here. It's a really nice look. I mean, I could wear it like this if I really wanted to, but it just really isn't. I feel like these need to be worn loose. I'm already looking at this bodysuit and I'm thinking, what was I thinking? I don't like it. Let's try it on anyway. Okay, don't watch it with the cycling shorts because it looks mad. The bodysuit, I don't like either. I just feel like it's not very flattering. Yeah, I just don't like it. No, 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 no. Corduroy, we've got corduroy everywhere. I thought this jumper was really, really nice. I like the shape of it. Let's just see what this looks like on. I like it, I like the shape, I like the size. I like the fabric. I changed my mind. I feel like I'm wearing a trash bag in this. I feel like we're too early. I was just wearing lemon and now I'm in a black sack. I don't know if I'm in the emotional mood for this kind of top just yet. It's not a bad top. It's not a bad top. Like with a pair of leggings or something tight on the bottom, I think it could be really, really nice. But I don't want to be this person. I don't want to wear all black just yet. Hey. Zara. Zara used to be my baby. It still is my baby. But I feel like if I don't go in Zara, I don't buy Zara. I found this dress. It's literally the same color as me. Um, I don't know if I'm going to look like I'm in camouflage or if I'm gonna look like a beautiful piece of chocolate that you wanna bite into. But this dress is giving me so much life. 79 pounds of this though. But I think it's so cute. Oh, kill her. Oh, I like this. I really like this. Oh my gosh, this is giving me figurine. Whoa, look at this semen right down the butt crack. This is giving me a waist. <gasps> it goes with my lipstick so hard. Oh my gosh, imagine. You could even wear it like this. 
Oh, yes, this is so nice. This is actually really nice. Very Jacquemus, very Jacquemus. I feel like it's a copy, but this is actually Zara. I think you've done, oh, oh, we need to pull it down. This is an amazing little dress. I might wear this. Could you wear this to an autumn wedding or is it too short? I'm dying, I'm dying, I'm dying, I'm dying, I'm dying, I am love it, I love it. For a second, I was very disappointed with the high street. I was just like, ugh. Just take me back to pretty little things. But this, we could just do a little snatch waist pose. And do you know what? Ruchin can hide a multitude of sins. I feel like Ruchin just makes everything look better. Rush, Rush me darling, Rush everything. I'm dying, I love this dress. Is it too short? No, I don't think so at all. Oh my gosh, I die. Living her best life. Living her best life. Okay, what else have I got from Zara? This little jacket. I saw these everywhere, but Zara had the softest one. This is not Bish I'm a cow, this is Bish I'm a sheep. I'm a sheep. This is giving me wool. I love it, I love it, I love it. I picked this up in the medium. Let me try it on, because I actually haven't tried it on properly. Bish I'm a sheep. Bish I'm a sheep. I love this jacket. Oh, see, this is how I want to wear my autumn. I don't want to be in all black corduroy, just looking sad. I need to bring vibe and vibrance and <gasps> texture to the season. This is just, uh, this is literally Patricia. This is me at the bus stop or waiting for the train. Cold, but cute. Cold, but cute. I saw these in almost every single high street store. There's almost like a variation of this one jacket, but this is my favorite one. Look at that, I'm warm. Tell me something. Tell me something, am I cold? No, I'm a sheep. I love this jacket. We got some last pieces from River Island. She got another long dress. Why did she get this? Is this cuter than the other one? Is this less supply teacher? Let's see. Okay, the dresses are very, very different. This is not giving me supply teacher. This is giving me head teacher with sass. It's very bodycon, very bodycon. The fight I had to get into this dress. My wig almost came off, but that's okay. Got to be has your girl protected. I love this neckline. It is a, such a flattering neckline. Again, if you don't have boobs, you've got shoulders, if you don't have shoulders, I don't know what to tell you. You can do angles, you can do angles. It's looking peachy. From the side, we're looking good. I, I'm really happy. I think this is really nice. But I would definitely get a size 10. This is a size eight and it's a fight to get into it. I don't need to fight into clothing. I'll tell you that for free. Oh, she got some stripy pants, did she? She got some stripy pants. These are giving me like boss girl pants and I like them. They're like super floaty, slightly cropped. Again, you'd wear them with trainers or like a sandal or something like that. I think they're really nice. I think they're really flattering and they're comfortable. <gasps> Comfort is king, people. <gasps> Comfort is actually king. I live for it. But these are like if you want to be a boss babe but you don't want to have everything on show but you want to feel empowered. <laughs> Why am I giving the trousers so many emotional terms? Like, these are my empowering boss girl pants. This is cute. Oh, more pants and more brown. Mm. We need these in every color. You better be cute on. Oh my gosh. Mm, these trousers. Mm. I love everything about these trousers. I love everything about these trousers my bum is glistening crotch a little long crotch a root a little long we've got a bit of fupa gathering but it's fine we're gonna act like you know that's not there because these are just such a vibe i know someone's gonna be like your torso is too short for those trousers patricia leave me alone and my little torso i think they're really cool why is the crotch lot the crotch needs to be this long like we can have it like this. I forgot, I had some accessories. I bought these really cute boots from Zara. A little Western, a Western backless boot. I feel like these are gonna look really good on. And they used to say you can't really wear black and brown together, but I don't know if I agree with that. I think I might need to get a size smaller to make the crotch not look so big. Dying, it's gorgeous, it's fabulous, darlings. I love it. 
Western boots from Zara, dry ankles from Africa, that's fine as well. Okay guys, that is me done. Trying on the goodies that I found from the high street stores. And I've got to say, shopping on the high street versus shopping online is very, very different. The clothing is different, the experience is different, what you pick up is different. It's actually kind of mad. And I actually realized that I picked up a lot of similar items from different stores because in reality, almost everyone's selling the same, not the same thing, but they're kind of close in style. But like there's some items I didn't even try on because I was like, hold on, you picked up that same thing in Topshop, Patricia. But what I feel like when it comes to shopping in store is that you pick less, I pick way less stuff in each individual store. And I think that I'm more confident in my purchases. Whereas I say when I shop online, it's like literally about, I, I keep 20% of the stuff because I end up picking up so much trash. Maybe because I'm a little bit crazy like that and I pick up everything that I think might look good and then it looks awful on me. Whereas in store, when I see it and touch it and feel it, I'm like, mm, yeah, no, it's not gonna work. And actually when you're thinking about all those clothes in your hand and how much they cost you, I think you're way more cautious. That's what like happened when I was shopping, I realized that. But like things when it comes to finding your sizing, the amount of time it takes, like online really does top that. Now that I've tried on some of these bits, there's still more bits that I feel like I want. So I feel like I'm gonna have to do another shop anyway um, for like my autumn like wardrobe and that kind of thing. So yeah. So guys, I think that is it for me. Do you guys even shop in the high street anymore? Let me know in the comments below. Is there anything else you want me to see? I've got some of your list of brands you want me to check out. Um, I've been burnt. I've been burnt by so many online brands. I'm like, I'm tired. You know it's hard out here for a shopper. But it's fine. I might check out and review some of those stores that you guys send me. So make sure you guys keep messaging me on Twitter, on Instagram. I read all your DMs. Even if I can't get back to you all, there are so many. But I really appreciate you watching my channel. Thank you so much. And I'll see you all very soon. Bye.